Good morning, Heritage. Today is Thursday, November 17th, and this is your Patriot Press News. My name is Reina Cervantes, and here are today's announcements. Patriots, your girls' water polo has a home game this evening at our new pool. Varsity plays at 345, so make your way over to support. We are excited to hand over our news to Marlene Garola for a special presentation. Hi, my name is Marlene Garola, and today we're here with Heritage High School's two previous students of the month. So, as a prior student of the month, tell me a little bit about yourself. Hi, um, I'm in Link Crew, I'm in CSF, I'm in the NHS. I'm in the school site council, and then I'm also in an officer for the Students for Change Club. I am the AVID president. I'm in NHS, CSF, and Student for Change's uh, assistant secretary. So tell me a little bit about Link Crew and what does it mean for you? So as a Link Crew leader, we kind of just support freshmen and mentor freshmen inside their classrooms, but then also outside. We have events about once a month. Um, right now we're having a Thanksgiving food drive, and then also we have um, freshman tutorings twice a month. Being AVID president, you have to organize all the events we do on campus. Like we recently had a spirit week and last week we had um, a fundraiser for selling grams and we did have a f another fundraiser at Canes. So basically all you have to do is just organize AVID around classrooms and around campus and just, yeah, that's it. Perfect. So what do you have planned for the future and how has Heritage helped you with that? Um, I plan on going to San Diego State University as an accounting and business major. And Heritage helped me specifically through AVID again because AVID helps me with all my college apps and scholarships and basically just preparing me for my future in, in college. So after high school, I plan on attending either UCI or UCR, majoring in mathematics, and I really enjoy um, the support and help that I have here at Heritage. So the final question is, what are some set goals you have for yourself? So some goals I have currently is to really just be more involved in the things I'm in right now. For example, in the Students for Change Club, we're hoping to get um, some of the issues we have resolved. In Link Crew, I'm hoping to just keep being in the support to the freshmen, help them get their grades up and help them get tutored. And I also plan on helping the school site council as well as the NHS with our projects that we have current going on. So tell me about some set goals that you have, Alice. Uh, the goals I have right now are to submit all my college applications and to start working on our um, AVID social for the end of the year. I really hope that we can get all the AVID students involved this time. And yeah, I'm just looking forward to that. Congratulations to both of you. We look forward to see what you guys accomplish in the future. Thank you, Marlene. Heritage, our next blood drive is November 8th, but signups are happening now and the week we come back, sign up today to help save a life. Up next, we give it to Julius for an announcement from GSA, followed by a preview of a newly uploaded vlogs from your senior film students. Hey Patriots, this month is Transgender History Month. Every November, we remember the history, good and bad, of the trans community. A transgender person is someone whose gender doesn't correspond with their sex. Transgender is an umbrella term, meaning that there are many terms underneath it. Today is Transgender Day of Remembrance, a day where we honor the here are those have, who have been lost to transphobic violence. In 2021, 350 people were reportedly murdered for her being who they are, and many cases went unreported. 2022 has been a, a year of uncertainty for the trans community, especially in the U.S., where legislation has tr been trying to be passed to prevent us from being who we are. But we continue to stand and fight for our rights. We will continue to be proud of who we are. Always know that there, that you have a safe space here on campus. Have a great day, Patriots. I'm currently working on the script. Um, so I've been working on this for maybe a good three days already. Um, but um, the plan is, it's actually almost done. It's not, it's like usually it took me, it takes me a while to write a script, but um, I'm feeling really confident about this one. Of course, it's not complete yet, but um, I'm hoping to complete it maybe by the end of this week. If not, um, maybe next week mostly. But I know Sam's got to do his project that I'm acting in. So this is going to have to wait a bit. But I'm super positive about this one. I think this might be my best piece of art, actually. If you guys want to see it, I'm probably just going to blur it out. There we go. I don't know where Genesis went. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my god, you 
you slow, prehistoric little machine? Scalpel, water. Ink nong. Oh. What if I just. So it's day one. Uh, for the California shakeout. You're saying it like it's a seven day process. It is a seven day process, bro. We should be out by now. That's all for today, Patriots. Have a great day, and we'll see you tomorrow.